Hello and welcome back. Okay, so on reflection, um, we decided to migrate the city to a fourth city. Uh, I think I'm going to change my mind and vassalize it instead. It's not got a great bit of land around it. It is only population eight. There isn't anything overly exciting in here. We've got a research node and we've got this um, silver tongue fruit, but I already have a silver tongue fruit here. So what I'll do is I'll make his capital my fourth city. That's assuming we're able to defeat him and wipe him out. We'll, we'll have to see. Uh, he has got a, another city up there now, which is fine. So I'm going to change this to a, a vassal. And we will slowly plod on. Two stacks up there. So these guys, oh, they're still invading. He is wasting a hero on this level one. Um, what kind of hero is this? It's melee. So we've got a Dark Knight in one turn. With that Archer, we, we should have enough to hopefully drive him out. So we've got a couple of units coming back through here. So they're going to be coming up through here now. Now, this doesn't tell me if there are more stacks. It could just be the one. Um, and it's really... It's really hard to tell on this kind of difficulty whether you're just overwhelmed with a ridiculous army. Um, so we have to be very cautious. Oh, she's done a defensive pact. I just checked this before I started recording. She wanted 600 for it. So that is a great deal. She also had some very interesting pieces of gear. One of them I have never seen before. Um, I'm going to quickly show you what they were. So there was a crown, which I've not seen. Um, so that's pretty cool. And then I would really like to get this. I've only ever seen this once. Um, but I love, I love the charge units in this game. I really, really think it's a great look. Um, so that we could get something like that for Frodo. Anywho, just thought that would be interesting to show. Uh, she, we can try and go for an alliance in 12 turns. So that's very good. So that's moving us in the right direction. We do have this mission over here. It is 24 turns. We probably will miss that. Let me just quickly check the strength of what it is they're looking for. It's a stack of five tier ones. That's fairly fairly comfortable right where is my army uh, ruler denounced empire skill available um, that's a very good one We've got quite a lot of um, Okay, we still haven't done this. I remember talking about this one rank. Um, didn't we order some stuff from the rally? Armies are being recruited. Okay, what did we recruit? Oh wow, yeah, we we recruited some big boys here. Okay, nice. Um 
How's our gold? We could do one more. Oops, sorry, that was my phone. Uh, that's a, what's this hell? Hell, hell, Birdia. I've got no idea what this unit is. Oh. So it's a pole arm. Uh, a soother? I don't know what this one is either. Start of Mending, Signet of Knighthood, Spell of Channeling. Interesting. Okay, so, sorry, before I move my units, um, we had a, a knight, that's a tier 3, uh, sorry, the archer's here, this was a tier 3 archer, so that's a knight archer, and then we got a, um, sorry, wrong buttons, we had a, I don't even know what that is. Oh, so that's a Battle Mage unit. Interesting. And that's a Tier 3. So that's gonna. this is going to be a very strong army, actually. So we've got two Battle Mages um, arranged. And so a Pole Arm would be quite good. Army's being recruited. Let's go for... Let's go for this Pole Arm and see... Although this unit could be good. No, we'll go for this one. Okay, I may miss him for the rank up. But let's let's have a look. Right, I have to be really cautious here. The amount of times I've made a mistake advancing too aggressively. And I just get overwhelmed. Um... Our armies are not bad, actually. We've got we've got some good t tier threes in there now. Okay, do we go up there? If that's two stacks, that's fine. It's very hard to tell. Okay, let's creep. Creepy, creepy. I'm a creeping. Okay, that's a good sign. That's only three units. Um, okay. No heroes. So this might be a good, op good opportunity to take out some of their units here. So we'll go for this battle. Um, who should we go for? Whoops, wrong button. So Sam, you can go in. In fact, you can probably initiate the fight. And Gandalf, you look pretty good. Yeah. So we'll leave you casually to just chill. In fact, I'll move you afterwards. Okay. Let's do a manual here. Or shall I do an auto? I'm going to do a quick save. I've noticed one of the one of the main reasons for my game crashing and then resetting the video is if I do a manual combat and then... Sorry, if I auto a combat and then I instantly manual it, it... It crashes probably one every three times. Um, let's do an auto combat. I, I don't know about you, but I've found that if I auto combat all the time, I completely lose touch with the skills, the race transformations that I have. Um, and it makes fighting later battles much tougher. This should be straightforward, hopefully, without losing any units. Okay, good. Good, good, good. We didn't lose too much health there either. 
So we do have another unit there. Okay. Um, right, how far can you move down? You can't move at all. Huh? Okay, Gandalf, you move. Okay, we're all within three of each other. So there's three stacks that can always be involved. That's good. Okay, so Sam, we've done a lot of uh, skills for his um, army. Experience leader, which we don't have, so we want that. Let's go for that one. So, like with with Sam here, it would be great to give him that um, lancer with um, with a horse. Man, he's on level nine already. Wow, that's pretty impressive. I'm just going to quickly check the buildings just to get a gauge of where we're at. Smith's good. What was that? Okay, I chose that for the food primarily, didn't I? Because food is very poor on this map. Tavern, yeah. The production and the morale were so bad we had to do those two buildings. And then, did the... Was this boosted? I not, can't remember. Tavern wasn't boosted. And that wasn't boosted. Oh, that sucks. That is massive amounts of waste. But this is an oasis, so I've got to remember that. That does give food. Okay. Um, we forgot to do this. Silver Wonder. Okay, good. Let's end the turn there. I forgot to check three. is good. I'm going to take this because we've got the population. I've got the money. really want the market though. But this is really important we get up. So let's take that. Okay, this is now a vassal. So let's give him a whispering stone. Let's check our three cities. Um... Okay, lithium is... Where's our other whispering stone? Oh, is that in my capital, maybe? Yeah. Okay, you're ready. Where are you? Okay, we'll deal with that in a minute. Um, let's sort out the free city stuff first. That's not in there. Did I put it in here, maybe? Because it was so bad. Yes, I did. Okay. Uh, three cities. Let's go. Okay, now our relations are, are bad. It's not too bad, to be honest. I will boost this. So that's vassalage in five turns. But I'm just going to check. Did we capture any of the heroes? We did. Let's inspect. Okay, he's got... This ring is quite nice. This wand is very powerful. And that is very good, but I don't like the slow movement, so that's no good for me. Um, well, I suppose when that would be good is I, I have a strategy where there's a couple of um, skills and equipment where you can teleport to four hexes away. So there's a cloak of armor, which causes you to teleport. There's also a demon step skill, a special, special skill, hero skill. So in that case, this would actually be very good because you don't tend to do a lot of movement with your main tank that's doing a lot of damage. Um, so with that strategy, that could be quite good, actually. 
So with this guy, I can give him freedom and that will boost our relations with him. Or we can kill him and get his equipment. Now, if I grant him my freedom, do we keep... Send the hero any equipment the hero has goes to your arsenal. Perfect. Okay, so we were on minus two. We will give him give him away. So that should now make our... Um, oh, have I given it to the wrong place? Who did that guy go to then? This guy. Pants. I should have checked where his home was. Okay, um, that doesn't really matter. I got the equipment and I sold him. I was going to do it anyway. Um, okay, so the wand was very good. I am going to give that to Sam. Because you need to be up, up and personal with a group of people for this to really be effective. Um, now, what, it gave me a bow. We don't want to have those. Do we want to try the legs? It is slow movement in combat, not on the world map, so I've misread that. That's good. But he doesn't have the tele teleport ability just yet. Um... Minus two resistance. I'll put that on you temporarily. Let's just quickly check Frodo. Um, okay, you've got a ring. Opportunity attacks, that's fine. Okay, so we'll leave the ring on Sam. Criticates. Oh, this is a great sword. What a great sword. Uh, what are your skills? Oh, what did you get here? Oh, why can't it show me? Oh, it's got draining blade. That is um Okay, you're only level seven. Ooh. City releases vassal, we know that. Silver fruit required. Ruler Sarah and Morgoth has returned. Fine. Hobbiton produced the knight. Bree can annex another sector. Um Let's get this gold mine on the line. I don't think we need any boosts. We've got four quarries, we've got three foresters. Um, so we'll do a mine there. The only thing I might need to do at some point is change this to a research post. In fact, I will do that now, because we only need three quarries. So that's dandy right let's get you guys over here and before I forget I am going to do this promotion now and that will also heal our armies that have just taken damage that's nice now can we reach this guy we cannot So I have to wait. So we've got two powerful units there, already rank three, which is great. Um, okay, Doki, I can't do anything more with them. Oh, the transmuter unit, this is great. Uh, leaf skin, I'm not going to bother with that condemnation. Still skin might be quite fun. Let's go for that. Um, gold. Gold is not great. Man, this city's really struggled. Okay, so that quarry's offline, that's probably why. Okay, we'll build those up again shortly. Bree had finished, didn't it? But we did that. Uh, Smith Guild. Is there any money? Mint. Three farms. Mm. 
man, the the lack of farm boosting has really slowed the cities down. Okay. Um, I have to confess, I'm nervous that some... If I'm already getting tier 4 units, like with that transmuter, I can't build the transmuter yet anyway. Um, okay, I'm not going to waste any money on siege projects. But we are going to raise this city, so I'm going to take out some of the um, some of the what's it called? What am I? What's the word? Pillaging. I'm going to get off some pillages. Um, okay, let's move you there, Gandalf. You've moved. You're staying there. Let's move you one. No, you can't. End turn. Another ruler was denounced. It's fine. New empire skill available. Ooh, what's this one? Outpost costs 50 gold less than take one turn. Yes, I will definitely take that. Especially in this world where we can't heal. Having an outpost is very handy. Um, I really should get this one now as well. I forgot I had that. Um, three cities or vassals with a whispering stone assigned grant 10 knowledge. We only have two in operation though, don't we? Sorry, wrong button. Is this one that we can get? So we've got two. 75. I'm going to spend a bit of Imperium here. I did not realise I could get a third whispering stone there. That was a waste. We will assign that... To are oh, they both at war? Um, mm. Okay, no mind. We can give the whispering stone back to here. Okay, you're happy again. You're very happy. You're very unhappy. Okay. So in case I haven't mentioned it before, I think I have. Um, a Whispering Stone gives two stability per turn to your city, up to a maximum of 20 per turn. Orders required. Let's go, my little chicken. Um, now, he's run off with the tail between his legs. I think these units should be able to handle him. If we could take him out, that would be very good. So we will do that. Um, these guys... We can start getting them into position to see if we can take this out. We should, in theory, be able to take that out. However, this stack here with the tier 5 is looking pretty ominous. Jeez. Anyway, it's very good that we've got a powerful army um, to just hang about here, so that's very nice. Okay, let's see. Turn one, let's move you yeah. up a little. I don't want to go too far. Uh -huh. Probably should be able to come up to here. That's one, two, three, that's not enough. Whoops. Hey. Okay, you can't move anymore. Okay, you gotta stay there, you're uh -huh. still going. Okay, that's fine. I can't I don't wanna risk putting Gandalf on there because he's got no support from a third stack. So we're gonna wait.
<clears throat> Harvest Festival. The city is well known for its impressive agriculture and it's now and now it has outdone its even itself. Food store oh, I can't read, man. Come on. Food stalls turn the grand square into a maze filled with aromas and flavours as children parade the streets with baskets, baskets full of the latest yield. There is no doubt that all the other rulers are in awe of this display of prosperity. Yes, I love it. Sell the extra produce. Um, 20 alignment. Imperium, we'll go for Imperium. So it's either the gold or it's the alignment. Now, I'm going to raise this free city and that's going to give us an evil alignment. And I found that when you're... They need to do some balancing with the... Uh, when you're warring and conquesting, if you really want to snowball and have m momentum, you need to raise some of the cities you go along with. Um, but it just... It just gives you evil alignment. However, saying that, I'm in a very strong position to do alliances. I've got three Whispering Stones. Um, I've got a lot of bonuses for alliances. So I'm thinking, actually, instead of raising, we'll just keep doing alliances or free cities. Um, so in this case, we'll take the gold. I think that's a good strategy. I've been playing so many maps where you, you um, where I'm not order, and uh, yeah, order's great for vassals. Uh, breach has been made. Your domain has been invaded. Oh, he's really gunning for it, isn't he? I wonder if we'll make it in time. Oh, so close. He's on a horse as well, isn't he? Yeah, so we're not going to catch him, are we? Okay, we'll bring him back. Alright, you go back over here. Breach made. Another ruler was denounced. And I love the fact we've got this army here. It's great. Summon Entwined is good. Faithful. Ooh, we've got some good spells here to use. Let's get this one. And then we'll do Harmy. Oh, it did it straight away. That's very nice. Let's get the army here ready. And then we will do a summon ready as well. Do we need to terraform anything? Can we repair these now? Yes, we can. Actually, maybe we can take this ore. We should be able to do that with our stack. So we'll come down and get this and we can finally get that fruit online um, okay let's attack so let's move you up one well that really doesn't need to have so many people um, Which unit should we take in? Wow, we've got a tier four there. I need to check that out. I've never seen that before. Um, okay, is that good? We seem very overpowered here.
Okay, I don't want to lose units. I'm not so worried about the experience. Oh, for Pete's sake. Um, for me, not losing units is the priority. We'll take that one off, I think. No, we'll, we'll keep pairing on. Okay, I do want to check that unit. It's just so... They just have nailed the design in this game. It's just so cool. So what is that? That is a Tyrant Knight. Why is this a tier 4 then? Shocking, it should not gain experience. Seal. Stand together, quick reflect. Okay, that's very nice. So that's a Tyrant Knight, but so is this unit. So what's the... Uh... Oh, this is just a Knight. Interesting. Army Hill, do we need to do that? I don't think we do. Good there. We could do it on that one. Why not? Okay. So we are very close to the capital. Well, how much movement points do you have, Frodo? Uh -huh. One, two, three. Good, and we are going to vassalize this again, aren't we? Uh, hero leveled up. So, Frodo, you are miles away from your special skill. Lord of War. While army le leader, after winning combat units in the army, we gain 5 health and 25% movement points. That's actually quite cool, um, but I'm not going to do it for now. Base attacks to spirit. Yeah, I keep saying this, but I just think the condemned mechanic is really meh. Um, and that could be because I don't understand it, but we're not doing a lot of status -y type of attacks. So for this build, for the order, it just seems it doesn't, doesn't really work. You've got Zeal that does two spirit damage. And then you've got Stand Together, which is 20%. Um, it's not like there's stuff doing bleeding and frozen and all of that kind of stuff. So, yeah, it doesn't really work for me. Adaptive Armor. Okay. Martial Expertise. What was that? Okay. Uh, Undying Loyalty. Target friendly use. Steadfast. That's quite nice. Feudals. Too specific. Whoa. Oh, that's forest only. Gosh, I was going to get that, but then it's only forest. Um, twenty percent upkeep that could be useful. We're doing all right for gold, actually, all things considered. Ah, strength training. There we go. That's what we want. One hundred percent. Um, remains of a hero has been collected. The shire has produced a. Gold, a guild, a smith's guild, set production at the Shire. Um, okay, I could do the Wizard's Tower. Again, I'm just, just not, not feeling it for the moment. Um, the mana is still quite low, but we're we're not the type of army that is casting a huge amount of spells all the time. I want gold. Oh, Tithe Collector. Special province, 10 gold. 10 gold per adjacent farm. Well, of course it is. Ah, but a forester. We can make loads of foresters. Okay. Okay. Right, we've got a plan. So it counts as a mine. Um. Right, we need to plant this then. 
So that's a forester. That's a forester. That's a forester. That. Okay, so what do you touch? You touch one, two, three. We can make that into a forester. So that's four. Perfect. So we'll make it there. Um, we'll put that there. Lovely. I like that. So... We will terraform that. Oh, we're, we're doing this one. Oh, has it cancelled it? Um, let's terraform and then do the entwined. So to terraform that, we'll make that forest. I'll probably will go for this first though. Um, that's good, that's three. And we've got plenty of quarries, so that's great. Okay, back to Sam and turn. Here we go. This is where it just gets ridiculous. Oh my days. Yep. As predicted. Wow. Yeah, just keep coming. Wow. They've made a boo-boo and they've given me a three stack here. They've also given me a two stack at the back here. What is this? Oh, look at the shadows. Isn't that cool? That's great. Um, so they made a boo-boo by splitting the army, which is obviously weakened. These three stacks here at the beginning do not have a hero. In fact, they only have one hero and that is Sauron. Who, interesting love enough, is only level five. That seems very interesting. Oh, I don't know what these are. Um, that's a very interesting staff you have there, my friend. Okay, so they're soul binders. Raise undead. Ah, oh, they've got these pole arms. They're very annoying, actually. They don't have a lot of ranks. These trolls are okay, they're manageable. Uh, what have you got? Okay, let's just quickly test to see what the... Oh, so you're bringing in Sauron, are you? Okay, so it's a convincing battle. I still want to try and avoid losing units if possible. Um, okay, I don't know why my movement is so bad. Like, I've literally to move two spaces. I suppose they consider that mountainous terrain. Can you go around the back? Oh, you almost can. So I went there. Anyway. Okay. So we're going to have to go for that battle. We will have to do that next episode. We received a trade deal proposal. Aragorn, shared vision, yes, yes, love it. Let's have a quick ganders at your stuff. <gasps> Face cloak, yes please. This was what I was talking about. So you move four spaces and then you can go in the back lines and do a big flank. So now that I've got that, how much does he want for it though? Let's have a look. 140 gold? Yes. I will definitely take that. So, negotiate. Pounding winged helmet. What is this one? Whoops, wrong button. 
Uh, I have not seen this one either. Oh, nice. Fearless permanently. Unit cannot lose morale. Okay. But I like that. How much do you want for that, sir? I will take that. Thank you, thank you. Um, let's see what can I sell you. Uh, yes, you can have that. And I'll do one more deal. You can have my bow. Do I want to sell the other staff? Now I'm going to keep that, just in case. I really don't want to get another hero that is magey. In fact, I'm definitely not going to. 20 gold, no thank you. Although the mana might be nice. No, I'll keep it for the moment. Okay, magic materials. You have a car a carnium ore. Oh dear, what's this? Meeting spine chilling Grim, grim arise. Grim arise. Salutation is great and powerful. Gandalf, please excuse the stench of death. <laughs> you may have noticed before our discussions. This this is part and parcel of our dark ways, not an omen of what is to come. Now that the people of Grim Grim arise have made your acquaintance, unless we are provoked, of course. See you. Okay, so you're neutral. Which is a good thing. Where are you, actually? Ah, because we've shared vision with Aragorn. Right, I see. Before I forget, I'm going to check my magic materials. We need the Arcanium Ore. So we will buy that from Aragorn. I had a feeling we needed that. Whoops, wrong button again. Diplomacy, negotiate... And we will buy this a hundred. Yes, brilliant. Thank you. Lovely. Um, while we're on a splurge of spending, let's just quickly check if you still have that. Oh, not for 600 gold. Come on. That's just... And I'd like to get this as well. Yeah. When, our, when we've got an alliance, hopefully our prices will be a bit better. So, um, we've got this Muppet Hero going through there, which we're definitely not going to catch. So let's send you back home. And we will move you... Um, let's just leave you there for the moment. Uh, now, let's do the vassals. We have... Oh, they... They like us. Weird. So who did we give the Whispering Stone to? We gave it to Bree, didn't we? Um, I'll give you the Whispering Stone. Lovely. How much to boost? 77? That was not worth it for two turns. I was hoping it would be three. Um... How far away are you? One turn. So we'll have a um, Whispering Stone 3, which will be very good. I'm actually amazed our gold is doing so well. But I do think our research is struggling as a result. But that will pick up. That's fine. Um, speaking of that. Your morale is low. We 
could go for that, couldn't we? Which can't be boosted. We do need to up your morale, so we'll go for that. That will get some research as well, so that's good. Gosh, these turns are taking ages. City is really vassal of a ruler who started a war. Who started a war? Yes, come on, Galadriel and, Ga and this is turning out very well. Oh, we've got to create the forest. Um. So wait, what? Doesn't work on mountains, that's a lot of ice. Oh, are you serious? I thought I could do this one. I've already gone through this, haven't I? How stupid. Ugh, that's just really annoying. I might as well do that. Um, you're going. We want this. Oh, we need this. Plus two defense. No, we want this. Let's get that, and then we'll do the uh, minor race. Uh, we've got the ore. Rings of binding collection complete. I want to see what that was again. Perfect. Still skin is done. Um, transmute resources. N wait, hang on. Target friendly city converts their mana. No. Okay, it's not too bad. Okie dokie. So, I think we will take this on. I may manual this because that could be quite fun. Um, but we will do that in the next episode. Guys, you're the best. Thanks for watching.